What's good, fam? It's your boy, Ed Love Live. I'm chilling with Mrs. Love. Say what's up, Mrs. Love. What's up, Mrs. Love? And got my boy right here, Mr. Sammy. Say what's up, Mr. Sammy. What's up, Mr. Sammy? See? <laughs> Y'all wondering how Sammy is just chilling because this episode is all about the pup. We're going to talk about Sammy's adjustment to the RV life full time because uh, it hasn't been an easy transition for my boy Sammy here. By the way, Sammy is, how old is Sammy? He'll be 11 next month. 11, he'll be 11, so he's becoming an old man. Oh Lord, I'm looking dark. I need to brighten up this a little bit. But anyway, so um, let's talk about Sammy. I have a leaf I gotta go kill. A who? A leaf. <laughs> Oh, okay, so Sammy may be leaving uh, this episode here. But anyway, so um, we didn't even consult Sammy when we decided to go uh, full-time RV, did we? No. We just did it. And then Sammy was like, what the hell? And so, uh, yeah. Um, but yeah, we got plenty of pictures of Sammy. He's been everywhere with us when we got the RV. He's traveled on every single trip. And uh, he did well when we traveled. Very well, chilling in the window, walking around. What else would he do? Yelling at people. Yeah, out the door. Yeah. What else? Um, he got filthy when we were at Fort Clinch. Hmm? He was dirty at Fort Clinch. What was, were we in a... Cause that was the dirt pad. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That was the, uh, we were in a dirt pad, so. Yeah, yeah, he got a little dirty, but he loved it. He had a great, he always have a great time when we go out camping or glamping, that is, because we ain't gonna sleep in no tents. But um, then it was time to move into the RV. All right, go ahead, boy. And uh, yeah, Sammy, he didn't like it. What were some of the things Sammy had to adjust to? Well, he's still adjusting, but. Yeah, he's still adjusting. You wanna talk to him? So, Sammy is used to sleeping with us. Yep. And he's used to sleeping on my side of the bed, which has always been uh, facing, not facing the door, but he would sleep like on the side of the bed or at the foot of the bed that faces the door. So in the RV, Eddie and I swap sides. Um, so the side that faces the doorway is actually Eddie's side. Um, so Sammy's still trying to adjust to the fact that if he sleeps where he normally sleep, which would be by my side or at my feet, he's not facing the doorway. So he gets up a lot at night and then he'll come camp out here. Um, so that's one adjustment that he's had. He, he's comfortable when he comes in here and he lays on the floor and he'll sleep good, but because we're not in here, then he'll wake up and come back in, jump up on the bed. Um, so yeah, he, he's slowly adjusting. He's doing better. Uh, he's playing with his toys now and yeah. he's acting a little crazy every now and then. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we kind of took him from a, a deluxe apartment in the sky to uh, an RV and he did not like that at all. But he's adjusting. Yeah, he seemed really anxious at first. Um, uh, like when we were working in the RV, when it was still um, parked over at the shopping center, um, we would take him too, just so he can kind of get used to his little surroundings. And he would just kind of sit in the um, dashboard, I guess. Mm -hmm. um, and he would just pant really hard the yeah. entire time. So that, you know, he was a little anxious um, on, what was our first trip? The first trip was the Keys, right? Yep. So we um, went down to the Keys, um, and he did a little better there. Um, yeah, and he seems to be more relaxed here. Yeah. Even though he's still stalking a Sammy, when we leave, he sits up here, and he stares out the windows waiting uh, for someone to come home. But... Um, he doesn't pant like he did in the beginning. Yeah. Even when we moved full time, he still would uh, pant really hard. But now, you know, he's just kind of normal with his breathing now. So we know he's adjusting, but he's just not all the way there yet. Yeah. So. Uh, are we all the way there yet? No, we still got some personal adjustments. The bed is, you know, we can't get used to that queen size bed. We're used to the king. So yeah, that's, that's a big adjustment. 
And so all three of us have to adjust to this new bed until we get the Mac Daddy RV bus that we're planning to buy real soon. And yeah. then we're gonna make sure that one has a king size uh, mattress, really comfortable for my wife and, and Sammy. So what else we gotta talk about with Sammy? Cause this is Sammy's show. Do you have any, are there any like suggestions you would give? Like uh, for adjusting with yeah. pets? Yeah. I don't know. We still no, trying either. to figure this out. Um, yeah. So we by um, no means experts on this, and yeah. we we just try to make them as comfortable as possible. And I don't know if you guys have some suggestions. Yeah, let us know. Let us know. Yeah. Um, because we're still trying to work things out. He doesn't tear anything up while we're gone. Uh, he never, never did that. Yeah, never he never did, did that. that anyway. Like he never chewed on stuff. Nope. Um, because we took his teeth out. <laughs> What uh? But what he used to do was pull all my stuff off for of the dresser. That's how we knew he was uh, not happy with us when we left because yeah. we would come home and it would there'd be a mess. Yeah, nothing we, would be destroyed, but it would just be a mess. Yeah, you couldn't leave like a purse on top of the dresser no. or anything. He'd pull it down and let it fall on the floor. Yeah, just to let us know, hey, I wasn't too happy with y'all leaving me yeah. by myself. Yeah, he's done that to Eddie's purses a bunch of times. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. I'm the comedian up in here. <sighs> so yeah, so that's Sammy's adjustment, y'all. Um, he's slowly getting used to it, and each day is a better day. So if you got any suggestions for us, let us know, and uh, we figure out things with Sammy. We'll let you guys know. But this is the RV journey. This just comes with it. And um, next week, next week, I keep saying this next week, we are going to get back to the renovation. And then next week, we're gonna talk about renovating the living room where we're sitting on the couch and all that good stuff, right? Oh, we tell the story about We're gonna tell the story about the couch. Yeah, and Chico and the man, we're gonna tell that story. Is that racist? Chico and the man, that yeah. was a, a, a comedy back in the 80s. Well, because I kind of feel like he was an angel. Ah, could be. Anyway, guys, we love you. Thank you for tuning in and uh, say goodbye, Mrs. Love. Goodbye, Mrs. Love. Hey, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, do what you do. And uh, we'll see you guys next week. We're going to have plenty of pictures and videos of what this thing used to look like before we renovated the living room. If you haven't checked out the renovation of the bathroom or the bedroom, please go back to episode one and two or two and three or, or three one of and, those or, or three, three and four, four, four and check out the renovations. Uh, we got plenty of pictures, plenty of videos. And next week, we're going to show you guys the living room and what we had to right. do. Right. What? I messed up my nails bad. Yeah, that's part of our journey. The RV journey is All messing right. up nails. Beep, beep. Beep, beep. Peace.